guys, look what I found. She is filling out a paper to vote in the US elections by mail. By mail. Fraud. This has to be fraud. When you do uh, all mail-in voting ballots, you're asking for fraud. Yes, mail voter fraud. Everybody is talking about it. Because of coronavirus, people are too scared to go vote in person. So they choose to vote by mail. And when you let people vote by mail, someone will commit fraud and steal the election. That is what a lot of people are saying about the US elections. But this paper is proof that they are wrong because this paper was mailed from the state of Utah. Utah! And in this state, everyone votes by mail all the time, even before COVID. And I bet not many people know that. For eight years now, people in Utah vote by mail. Every single person gets a paper in the mail. They choose their candidate and they mail their vote back. And the shocking part is, there is no fraud. When my girlfriend votes like this, her mail will be tracked, her signature will be checked, and her information will be verified. There are only five states in the United States that allow everyone to vote by mail. And so far, there is no evidence of fraud from Democrats or Republicans. Not now and not eight years ago. The only evidence they could find is that voting by mail makes more people vote. Take Colorado for example. Just like Utah, everyone can vote by mail with or without COVID. That's probably why Colorado has one of the highest percentage of voters in the country. Hi, my name is George Stern and I help run elections in Colorado. In Colorado, 75% of us vote. That's a very high percentage, and it's because we've made the process simple, fast, and secure. If Utah and Colorado can do elections by mail, then I'm pretty sure other states can too. In the middle of a pandemic, no one should have to go stand in line for hours. No one should get COVID. No one should risk their life just to vote. This isn't even about the US, this is about elections. There is a reason people don't vote in democracies. It's because the process is too damn hard or too damn complicated. We need better, easier ways to have elections because at the end of the day, you cannot call yourself a democracy if you don't let people vote. See you next week. One, two, three. Before you go, one last thing. That video you just saw, I made using this camera and this microphone. But for the first time ever, I'm ditching my camera and I'm picking up my podcasting equipment. Because yes, I'm starting a podcast. It's called Nas Talks. It's free and it's only on Spotify. And if you liked that video, I think you're gonna love the podcast because I just wanted to make a podcast about things that I would listen to, about topics that I wanna listen to. Yes, Nas Talks is 100% honest and raw and deep. And by the way, it's 100% free. So keep your money and give me your ears because if you like this video, I think you're gonna love this podcast. See you on Spotify.